The Charleston Fire Department hosted a mini fire academy where the participants were strictly members of the city council and city, city staff. That's right, Kaylee, and this is the first time the department has done this. I went to the event and saw just what happens when the staff goes from voting on city issues to putting out fires and rescuing civilians. After being taken out of their normal environment, the Charleston City staff donned firefighting gear and went into the flames. Fire Chief Steve Bennett says the simulation was the department's way of showing the staff just how difficult it is to do this job. Um, we just wanted them to come out here and show them exactly what we do, put them in our shoes so they can get the feel of what we do on a regular basis. Daily activities like vehicle extraction, CPR, Five miles away. and fire dousing. Bennett says he thinks the last challenge was the most effective. None of them have really been in uh, close quarters like that with a bunch of smoke where you can't see and really hot. So I think they really kind of enjoyed it. And I think some of them may have gotten their eyes open on this one. Retired city council members Tim Newell could agree. He says the experience was not what he expected. Every, every aspect of this was uh, very, very surprising, I guess. It's just that, that, oh my goodness, this is, this is much more difficult than I would have thought. So difficult that Newell doesn't think this could have been his original job. I really walk away from this just thinking I was only around the edges of the real life situation. I mean, this was all simulated uh, and they walk into situations every day that are unknowns. And after walking a mile in their shoes, Newell says he's developed a new respect for the men in uniform. And I have to admire anyone that pursues this as a profession because you, you have to at all times really be ready and know what you're going to do to help people. Bennett says the Mini Fire Academy was a success and everyone was happy with the outcome. He says there's a chance the department will host an event like this again in the future.